Hey guys, this is Vignesh and I'm a travel YouTuber. Uh, from a long time I have this item in my bucket list that I want to get scuba diving certificate. So I looked up in, in Google where I can get it in Pondicherry. So I found out these guys, Temple Adventures and uh, I'm going to be doing the open water course with these guys and I'm going to show you the experience as well and how easy it is for you also to get certified. Uh, it's a four day course and you can split it between weeks. So it's not that you have to do the four days at a stretch. You can split it between two weeks as well. So I'm going to be doing this course with these guys which gets me certified to dive uh, up to 18 meters all over the world. So I'm sure this is going to be very exciting and it is very exciting for me as well and I'm nervous because I haven't done scuba diving before. All it requires is that you should know how to swim. If you don't know how to swim you can still take the discover uh, scuba diving session uh, which is for two days and uh, that is just for you to experience scuba diving. So let's go and get the open water certificate. So first you are greeted with uh, some uh, instructors where uh, they instruct you to fill some uh, you know paperwork these are consent forms and you know just your communication uh, details and emergency contact numbers so once you're done with the paperwork now i think we have to go and take the theoretical course let's go or oh, you can start with watching videos first so the video lectures are like there are five sections in it which you'll be watching in which every section talks about a certain uh, thing related to scuba diving like one will be related to equipment one will be related to physiology so it covers your whole theory open at open water level basically you learn most of the skills that's where you start for understanding scuba diving a lot better in terms of physiology physics uh, we'll start with your videos then you have to solve some knowledge reviews mm -hmm. same like the five sections of the videos there are five knowledge reviews which you have to do uh, it's just the open book sort of a thing where you can refer the manual and then you can uh, solve your knowledge reviews it's exciting being a diver because underwater you experience new sensations you feel pressure swim almost weightlessly which way Boat. Come here. Get with your buddy. Okay, so I came here 8.30 in the morning, but uh, now it's 4.30 p.m. and I've completed all the videos that uh, I had to watch. It was a long day full of theoretical stuff. Tomorrow the actual fun begins where I get trained in the pool. Super excited for tomorrow, guys. And I'm loving this place, I'm loving the vibe, I'm loving the people here. It's gonna be fun. So let's go. So, end of day one. So super excited for tomorrow. Santos! Day begins. Hey guys, so today is day two of the uh, training of the open water course, and uh, today is going to be super exciting because we are actually going to see all the scuba gear. We have two kind of trainings today. One is in the tub that's over here. Uh, and uh, the other one is in the confined pool area. In pool sessions also there are five pool sessions. So confined one to three skills are done in a small tub which is right outside I'll show you. And then four and five are mostly done in the big uh, pool which is like so, just nearby. Yeah. It is around yeah, seven, eight feet. So there we'll practice more neutral buoyancy to swim with the fins and everything. Okay. Initial stage, we'll practice more related to the equipment like mask and all. So if water goes into your mask, if you're straight away in a big pool like 8-9 uh, feet deep, it's difficult to come up, right? So yeah. according to Paddy standards, you have to be in shallow water, which is where coming out of the water is easier for you in case you panic initially because not all people are comfortable in water immediately. Mm. So the pools over here at the dive center itself, they're like 4 feet barely. So even kids can like quickly stand up. So super excited about today. Let's see how it goes. So 
look at our instructor cooking. What's the speciality? This is my special red chili omelette which I make every time before I go diving. Scuba gear is something that needs to be handled with utmost care. After all, this is the only thing that's keeping us alive deep in the ocean. That's why the training covers a step-by-step process of how to set up the diving gear, which involves the inflatable jacket, technically known as the BCD, that is the buoyancy control device, checking the integrity of the cylinder, the regulator, and the pressure gauge. I was instructed to repeat the process of setting up the gear and taking it apart five to six times. And every time I made a mistake, I owed Viraj a beer. Luckily, I did pretty well. So we are all suited up. I'm wearing my weights now, according to my body weight. All ready for the pool uh, session. So let's go. Once this phase is done, now let's go to the pool. How you feel, sir? Now that we've grown comfortable with the scuba gear in the small tub, it's time to head to the larger pool to get used to swimming with this gear and learn more skills. Okay, now we are at the uh, larger pool, uh, which is about seven feet uh, deep. Right, so we're going to be learning more skills here and uh, it's going to be exciting. Let's go. So now we are at the swimming pool where we have to complete two tests uh, for the open water uh, course. The first one is that we have to swim 200 meters. So that's eight laps of this swimming pool uh, without stopping. Then the second test is uh, the 10 minute float test. Uh, you have to stay above water for 10 minutes straight without taking a support and without going down in the water. So both of these are very challenging tests. So let's see how I do. Feels good. After completing this pool session, I was really comfortable underwater and I just couldn't wait to get to the ocean.
The moment I backflipped from the boat into the ocean, I freaked out for a few seconds. But as I looked down, I was greeted with a beautiful batfish and I slowly entered into this peaceful state. As we went deeper and deeper, all I could hear was my heartbeat and nothing else. Trust me, this is a beautiful feeling. There was this one last exam that I needed to complete, to complete the course. I was almost sleepy by this time, but I finally did it. 
Okay, cool. So we'll just go through whatever is wrong. Okay, guys. So we just finished our ocean dives number three and four. So in the open water course, you have to do four ocean dives: one and two on one day, and three and four on another day. Um, so today I completed my ocean dives number three and four. It was so cool to see all those fishes up so close, you know, in its own territory. By completing this course, I get a certificate which is valid globally, which allows me to dive up to 18 meters. So that makes us eligible to dive in so many cool places around the world. We are so lucky to have institutes like Temple Adventures in Chennai and Pondicherry. Especially the Pondicherry one, which I experience right now, is amazing. The community, the way the people are like a family, and how they treat the customers and the students as well. is really amazing so if you are looking for a scuba diving experience or if you want to gain a certificate definitely check these guys out you will be in for some amazing experience which you will cherish for your lifetime definitely and if you do a certificate course i'm sure you'll be diving in more cool places around the world so this is a great opportunity and uh, if you are anywhere near chennai or pondicherry you should definitely come and check these guys out Another cool thing about this course is not only you learn scuba diving but also about the marine life and about how to conserve and protect the ocean as well so which is a really great thing because uh, a lot of the species uh, that we see today might not exist tomorrow and it's up to us to you know be responsible and protect those species so scuba diving is all about knowing the marine life as well along with learning the scuba skills So there is a lot of information and knowledge that you can gain in this course. But if you're not looking to do the course and you just want to scuba dive for the experience, you can do that as well with the Discover Scuba Diving uh, program that they have. Probably the best thing to do if you just have one weekend in your hand. By the way, if you happen to contact Temple Adventures after seeing this video, I would highly recommend you to tell them that you contacted them after seeing Vignesh's video. Who knows, you might get a discount, and who doesn't want a lovely discount, right? So do like the video comment about your feedback about your opinion and if you want to go scuba diving in the comment section below and don't forget to share the video let's go scuba diving <laughs> <laughs>